Hello guys, I'm back. We are still talking about what is going on, what is trending in Nigerian politics. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you all, depending on your location at this time of the day. Okay guys, um, I don't want to waste much of your time. You have seen that already on your screen. Now, I told you guys um, last year, okay, um, that people are waiting for the right time for them to do the right thing. Yes. And then the, it is beginning to happen. Okay, so this is Kaduna State. You have seen that just in Kaduna Deputy Speaker, member Dom APC for Labour Party. Yes, I told you many people is waiting for the right time for them to do the right thing. Now, this is Kaduna State. Remember uh, last year when Labour Party wanted to organize their rally in Kaduna State, Erufai, their governor, says um said that um peter ob is not popular in kaduna said that even if labor party organizes um, a rally uh, that not more than 200 persons uh, will come out to rally for peter ob but when kaduna organizes a rally for peter ob it was a huge blow for herufa himself now it was not even only herufa even his son came out on twitter um, saying that if Peter Obi should win an election, something he was bragging about popularity of Peter Obi. Okay, but ever since Labour Party organized this rally in Kaduna, said all of them went had to cover their face. Okay, they went into hiding. Okay, so um, the Deputy Speaker of the Kaduna State House of Assembly, Isaac Auta Zankai, and the member representing Zaria State constituency, Suleiman Dabu. Both of them have defected from APC to Labour Party in Kaduna State. And the Deputy Speaker is representing the um, Kura State constituency in that state. Now, this is APC State. Like, seriously, this is APC State. Now, you know, people would have reacted that, oh, it is Peter B. Brother. If this were to happen in Southeast, they would say, okay, uh, now Peter B. Brother. Uh, this and that. This is happening in the north. Yes. Top APC state. Erufa is top APC member. And I told you guys, these people supporting Tinibu, forget about it. Of course, it's politics. If you bring your money, I will eat it. That is what politics is all about. Now, the Erufa, let me shock you guys. Before the um, primaries and so on, Erufa that was supporting Tinibu almost going everywhere with Tinibu. When last did you see Erufai? Or have, did you, have you seen Erufai on the campaign train of Tinibu? No. Now, let me shock you again. What about Ganduje? Okay, what about Ganduje? He was strongly supporting the um, Tinibu, but he was following Tinibu up and down everywhere. But of recent, nobody uh, seems to see Ganduje, you know, gumming body with Tinibu of recent now it's it's simple these guys they are all politicians now a typical example during the primaries there was a uh, one uh, police dpo people approached the man convinced the man to come out and contest for election only for the man to bring out his life savings hoping that he will win primaries but what happened the same people that approached the man collected his money didn't even support the man so that is politics for you so if somebody comes out to play politics and then wants your support, of course, it has to do with money. That is how Nigerians play their own politics. So many of them, I told you guys, um, pretending to support APC or Tinibu himself, at the right time, exactly time, they will do the right thing. And this is beginning to happen, like seriously. So in a few days to come, this is what may likely play. Okay, guys, let me know what you guys think. Um, everybody already knows that Labour Party, Peter B, is heading somewhere. With the backing and support of the elite, Peter B is heading somewhere, okay? Uh, let me know what you think. I quickly want to update you on this. See you guys in another update.